Welcome back to 76 Ground School Chick. In today's video, I'm going to walk you step by step through the run up procedure in a Cessna 172 Sierra using X Plane 12. This is a super important part of any flight. It's how we make sure the engine is healthy and ready before takeoff. I'll guide you through exactly what to do, what to check, and what each instrument is telling you, all using real-world procedures for a fuel-injected C-172. So whether you're training, simming, or just curious, this is for you. We're in the run-up area near the hold short line for runway 09er. Brakes are set. Let's walk through the run-up checklist. First, parking brake set. I always like to hold the toe brakes firmly additionally. Then we bring the throttle smoothly up to 1800 RPM. Hold RPM steady and check engine instruments. We see that the oil pressure is in the green, oil temperature is in the green, ammeter is charging, and suction gauge should read between 4.5 to 5.5. Next, we check the magnetos. We turn the ignition switch to left. You should see a slight RPM drop, no more than 150 RPM, and it should run smoothly. We turn the switch back to both. Now we turn the switch to right. A small drop is expected, no more than 50 RPM difference compared to the left. Back to both, RPM should return to where it was. Now we lean the mixture slightly for best power, especially if we are at a high density altitude airport. We confirm again, engine is running smoothly, temperatures and pressures in the green. Since this is a fuel-injected 172, we do not have carb heat, so we skip that step. Now we pull the throttle to idle, check that the engine runs smoothly and keeps running. Bring the throttle back up to 1000 RPM for taxi. Run-up complete. In our next video, we'll review the before takeoff checklist and make our departure radio call. That's it for the run up. If you found this helpful, make sure to like and subscribe. There is plenty more coming. Now, if you want to go deeper, I've created a series of exclusive videos covering radio communications what to say, when to say it, and how to sound like a pro at both towered and non-towered airports. That series is available only for channel members, so if you'd like to support my work and get access to that bonus content, click the join button below this video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.